Hi, good afternoon. My name is uh, Yuvan Bijadar. I'm an associate professor, visiting professor of blue diplomacy and marine governance at the Geneva School of Diplomacy. I teach this course because I'm really passionate about the oceans and sustainability at large. Um, coming from a small island in the Indian Ocean, Mauritius, the oceans, my relationship to nature, to our ecosystem and natural capital has always been very much present in my DNA. Over the years I've worked as a technical specialist on sustainability issues, more specifically the blue economy at the World Bank. And uh, this semester I'll be teaching this course with bachelor students, masters and executive masters to really help students to think through that um, dichotomy between sustainability, growth, the economy and climate change. And what is it going to take for the future, for future blue diplomats as they start thinking about the agendas of the blue economy and sustainability. Then the world agrees to a package which includes the development, eventually, of the SDGs. But also the idea that we need to also talk about the finance. That was another big problem that the UN was faced with. You know, we talked a lot about the topics, the framework, the agenda, but nobody had thought about the finance. How are we going to finance the sustainable development goals? What is it going to mean to them to help negotiate and renegotiate contracts which make sense for countries, companies, CSOs, civil society organizations. Because in the future, countries will be facing increasingly more potential conflicts on the oceans. We've already seen it. There's a lot of countries that are fighting over natural resources, fisheries and others, minerals. In the future, we're going to need students who understand these topics, who understand how, how to address those issues in an impartial way because a leader of tomorrow is going to be one who can take bold decisions, difficult decisions, who can sort of address those issues and those interplays in a very smart and sustainable way and look at different perspectives. People are consuming also a lot differently and so that's going to also mean how do we produce differently. As you said, sustainable fashion, what does that really mean? Technically that should mean we need to buy less we need to buy one clothes less every month, as opposed to two. But the pressures remain. People buy, want to buy, they don't want to trade, they don't want to buy necessarily second-hand products. So there's going to have to be a need, a, a movement to wake up from society to say, enough is enough. The Geneva School of Diplomacy, being in Geneva, Switzerland, presents a lot of opportunities to address these issues and also hear from international organizations, the WTO, the WHO, WIPO, um, the Global Fund, Gavi, and other organizations, as well as the diplomatic community, to really see what these issues are, how we find solutions, and how do we build a more sustainable world, very much in line with the Agenda 2030 on sustainable development. Thank you.